Hello, my name is Marcus Lai. Uh, I'm the head chef of uh, Deco Restaurant. We are here today to give you some tips. How can you reduce waste in your house during these pandemic times? Nowadays, we are doing more shopping because we are staying home way longer. And pickling, which is the tip that we're going to give you today, is a very good option for you to give a second life to your vegetables. Today, I'm going to do a non uh, common pickling process. Uh, I'm, I chose sweet potatoes instead of the normal cucumbers or beetroot, which you can still use. And this is the thing that it's good for you that you can think a bit out of the box. It's not only what you usually buy in the jars that you can pickle, it's pretty much all the vegetables that you have in the house that you can pickle. We're gonna start with the sweet potatoes. The pickling process is very, very simple. Basically, you just need spices, you need your vegetable, and you need water and vinegar. In this case, we are using apple cider vinegar, water solution, spices and the vegetable. First process that we're gonna do with this uh, recipe is to cut the vegetable. I did all the cutting of the potatoes now. Uh, usually I would suggest for you to do a ratio uh, equal from the weight of the vegetable that you are pickling with exactly the same amount in uh, milliliters of water and vinegar. So in this case, if I have 500 grams of sweet potato, I'm using 500 milliliters of water and 500 milliliters of uh, apple cider vinegar. Once I have all the vegetables cut, you can put already in a jar. I would suggest for you to buy um, these jars that have hair sealing so it doesn't create oxidation. I have already uh, water and vinegar already mixed. So you just pour it all in a saucepan. You start to add your spices. In this case, I wanted to do some more tropical variation of my pickles. So I use lime leaves that I can do like three or four. I mix with bay leaves as well, three or four, some cloves, and then I add two teaspoons of coriander seeds, two teaspoons of mustard seeds, two teaspoons of black pepper seeds. Sugar and salt are very important, so two tablespoons of each. So after you do, you put all the spices together with uh, your water and vinegar solution, uh, you have to simmer for three to four minutes. So the spices already blend with the liquids and uh, the sugar and the salt melt. So now I'm gonna go to the, to the stove and do all this process. The simmering process is done. Um, I'm gonna add the dates that we have on the recipe only now, because if I would add during the simmering, they would cook uh, more than I want. So you add like two, three dates for some uh, natural sugar. And basically you just have to pour the whole solution in the jar. Close it. As you can see, the process is done now. Um, I would suggest for you to keep this for about a week. Uh, so it's ready. So the pickling juice actually goes through all the sweet potato. Um, and you can use this as a snack, as a healthy snack. You can uh, add this to your salad. Uh, and you can keep it forever because now it's preserved in a very good way. And this you can do with all the vegetables that you have that are going bad in your house and avoid the waste, which is the whole purpose of uh, this uh, video. It was Marcus from uh, Deco Restaurant. Uh, please follow us in our social media, Instagram and Facebook. And wait for the next video because it will come.